Good morning, this is Data Explorers and I'm Jessica Johnson. The regulatory news first of all and Australia's financial market watchdog, the FMA, said on Tuesday it plans to extend the ban on short selling of shares of two of its major banks and two of its major insurance firms. The ban, which runs out to the end of January, will be extended for three months until the end of April, the FMA head Kurt Pribil told journalists at a briefing today. On Tuesday, we were able to see Friday's short-selling trading activity on the day when the short-selling ban of financial stocks in the United Kingdom was lifted, and we will update you with this activity throughout the week. There was little movement in Friday's activity on the short-selling front, with Barclays increasing its position slightly from 3.14% of its shares outstanding on loan to 3.2%. Um, Utilisation, or the percentage of the supl- supply excuse me, available to borrow, however, did increase quite a lot from 17 to 19.5%, um, which is obviously an indication of how quickly supply could be running out. The short position of HSBC also increased, but only minimally from 1.53 to 1.58% of shares on loan, as did Lloyd's TSB from 1.19 to 1.27, and Aviva and Prudential also saw a minimal rise in their short positions from 0.16 to 0.2% and 0.18 to 0.23% respectively. And we will be back tomorrow with an update on the activity throughout the week. And for more information about Data Explorers, please visit dataexplorers.com. Many thanks. Have a great day.